Ahmed Al Masri has come from Gaza to Qatar looking for investment. He's invented a robotic glove that's designed to help Palestinian people whose hands are paralyzed through injuries sustained during conflicts with Israel. I hope we can come out with this as a prototype. I hope if there is any company or any agent can support this project, then we can make uh, multiples of this robotic hand glove and provide it to the patient in Palestine, especially in Gaza. And we have a lot of patients with paralyzed um, and ambition hands after the ugly war happened there. Competitors from more than 40 countries are taking part in the first ever Challenge and Innovation Forum in Qatar. Judges will evaluate the best ideas over the next two days and award cash prizes for those placed first, second and third. There's up to $250,000 of prize money to be won. Once the winners from here have been chosen, the participants will be divided into teams. They'll then compete to design, build and test an idea from scratch over a 48-hour period. One of the organisers is an inventor himself. He knows firsthand how difficult it is to get investment for new innovations. Normally, uh, for, as an inventor, it's very hard uh, to start up your company. So what we are doing here, uh, we bring the uh, inventors and we call a lot of research and start up companies to meet them and uh, we hope it will be start of a new business for them. It's hoped this will become an annual event. The winners will be announced in a week's time. Victoria Gatenby, Al Jazeera, Doha.